Greetings friends and welcome to this 2023 New Year's video. We wish you a happy New Year 2024. Hallelujah! Hallelujah. <laughs> and to be continued. Yes. <laughs> yes, we want to start to thank everybody that's been uh, standing with us in different ways uh, around the world. Yes, uh, we thank you. You have been with us and having shown compassion to us, work with us, uh, prayed for us, and uh, you have been given financially or sharing our information in public media. And especially, of course, our sponsor, Royal Design. Mm, amen. And what we do, all of you out there that have been with us in this, have a part of. You have a part of what we do. And it's not our ministry, it's God's ministry. Jesus' ministry. Yeah, it's all about Him. Mm. So thank you so much for that. Uh, Camilla, it's been an uh, exciting year, if you look back. Yes. It's been very intense. Uh, and we started the year by going to Bolivia in January. Mm. And uh, it was not super easy to come there. No, because it was not easy to enter the country or uh, exit. Yes, it was almost civil war. And the only uh, way to come in was actually to the airport, which, which was open and closed on and off. And, uh, but we felt led by the Holy Spirit to go there, and it was very successful. Mm. And uh, we made a new uh, newsletter, and our web guys are working on it right now. Mm -hmm. And, uh, and uh, you can read much more about details of all the things that been happening in 2023 in that, that one also. But it was very good in Bolivia, and then after that we went to Germany yes. and did a core training. And uh, these guys are continuing and we rejoice with you guys, Arthur and the, the team down there. God bless you guys and keep up the good work. And then uh, we went to Croatia. Yes. Yes. But before that, we actually moved up uh, north in Sweden. Yes. Uh, so we basically established something new up here and it's been more like apostolic work. Uh, to go from one place, you have nothing prepared basically, you just need to start all over again, put your hands in the soil and start digging and find these gold nuggets and do something with it. Mm. So it's, it's exciting, but it has been hard. Uh, a lot of persecution, uh, death threats, uh, it's been uh, lies, both from Christians, but also and our own people, and uh, people turning against us, and, and in different ways, but we also rejoice in this because we, we, we can read about this in the Bible. Yes. <laughs> yes. And uh, you guys out there, you know about this also. When, when persecution comes, uh, it's also success many times. God has something very good going in them. The Bible says we should rejoice always, but it's not always easy. So when you do uh, uh, see persecution, mm. I pray that uh, uh, we, you, as we are humbled and softened in our hearts and mm. only hard in our heads yeah hard foreheads yes yes it's very easy to uh, get this especially when you see other religions and, and wars and things that you get anger in your heart but we need to turn it that into love and you know see the, 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 with the lens of god and love people you, you will not hate anybody to christ you, you need to show the love and compassion of christ and people turn yeah we did uh, uh, two good videos about how uh, god sees you through the lens mm -hmm. of christ the blood yes uh, it's not about us mm. but about yeah, him yeah. but also that we can expect uh, in the new covenant that jesus is with us we get favor yes. and he uh, provides for us yes mm. the covenant and the lens is the movies yes the, the videos so you can watch those on the youtube and we also released a new uh, movie now called the disciple maker and we encourage you to watch that one it's very good tim Curvin came over with his camera from scotland and he made a very good recording and it's going to be encouraged to watch that one and share it with others also. It makes it very simple. Yeah, very, the simplicity of following Jesus Christ. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And, um, and then we went to Croatia. And it was very good also to establish a new team there. Yeah. And these guys uh, had, uh, also, are also continuing. Yeah, it was awesome. But don't you remember something that happened in Sweden? Tell me. TBC Växjö. Yes, of course. <laughs> How can we forget you guys? <laughs> uh, yeah, I want you to let, let all of you know out there also that every day, me and Camilla, we are praying for the different teams around the world in South America, North America, Africa, Asia, Europe, all around the world. So we're with you in this. You're not alone. And we also, many of you guys, we're speaking regularly also about, uh, so you're not alone in this. We are, we are in this together. Yes. But we established a new uh, um, connection of the to be continued down in Vekua. And these guys are real on fire. Yes. They're continuing. Mm -hmm. And we're going to, sooner or later, we're going to go down there and uh, we're going to um, um, have a core training. 
But they also decided, uh, because there's been a lot of persecution, we can see this has been planned attacks also, that they are not so public before we do something now. Mm. Because we can see how the enemy is using this and people are actually making evil plans against us when mm. we tell what's going to happen before. Mm. So we are a little bit more secret right now and we have no like an open calendar and so on. Uh, because we want to see the kingdom grow and not be destroyed by the enemy. Yes. Yes. Mm. Amen. But thank you guys. It was a short summoning of the, the uh, 2023. Go to the newsletter, read about it, and be encouraged. Uh, keep up the good work. Don't stop. Continue, even though there's persecution, tribulation, the world is on fire. But we need to continue because this is the Bible. Yeah, because there are people out there that don't, they don't know Christ. Mm. And they are going to, be, to go lost yes. for eternity. Yeah. And we need to make disciples and to see what Jesus started 2,000 years ago. The movement to continue. Yes. And I think you guys know that we need prayers. And I think also you guys that know us, that know that we will not stop. It doesn't matter what happens. We will continue until the end. So the enemy is wasting his energy also trying to stop us because we will continue. That's the way it's going to be. Mm -hmm. God bless you guys. We love you guys. Thank you for everything you're doing for us. And um, to, to be, be continued. continued 2024. Yes. <laughs>